Hey guys, Joe Cool here. Welcome back to another episode of Feed the Beast Unleashed. So you can see today I'm rocking the redstone hat. Yeah, we're going to do some redstone stuff today. So uh, I wanted to show you something really cool. So here's my smeltery. And I've got some mo molten co cobalt in there. So as you know, you can throw a uh, redstone clock in here. And it'll... Um, it'll pulse this faucet and then it'll um, pour the liquid out and then I've got a hopper underneath which it'll put it into uh, this container here but as you can see I've got a drawbridge oh man this sucker is awesome check this out so open up that hole there and I'm gonna put the drawbridge right there and then here you got two interfaces let's see um, I believe so that way's south so let's try that and maybe that'll work okay so then we need to this is the slot where you put all the stuff in so then I went and I got a switch where's my switch at Drink. there we go ha <laughs> ha check that out turn it off and then here's the best part Blink. where'd it go <laughs> oh that's sweet Blink. there we go <laughs> I think that's pretty sweet I don't know about you but that's pretty sweet <laughs> all right so um, plan on doing today so we've got um, got these guys here and oh man they are just so slow it's been going for I don't know how long I've got maybe 30 or, so, or whatnot so what we need are some frames Oop. frame and the one we're going after I think is this one the impregnated frame so we can craft this but we need string not too bad and then some impregnated sticks, which is going to be wood. Need lots of wood. And then we can use our creosote oil that we've already got, which is takes 0.01. So I can make 200 impregnated sticks with a bucket of creosote oil. And I've got 350 buckets going right now. So I'm um, doing pretty good. <clears throat> so we'll be able to make those for days. But what I'm going to do is, um, so this is my farm chunk right here. And I've already kind of separated stuff out. I've already got, you know, that guy there and that guy there. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go down um, another couple levels and I'm going to install another farm for cotton. Now if we look at cotton or not cotton ball what is this cotton oh did I spell it Owen? okay um, so you can put cotton seeds down and they grow little um, stems or whatever and these cotton um, uh, ends up on top of it and so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna make um, <clears throat> you know make an ender chest um, I'm also putting a, um, it'll probably end up being my, I don't know, it'll be my frame factory. So I'll have, um, it'll produce the impregnated sticks to produce the impregnated frames. And then um, I'm going to put the frames inside an ender chest. And then over here at my um, facility right here, my facilita. Um, I'm going to put the put a matching ender chest here, <coughs> which is going to feed into all of these. Oh, I was too close. <laughs> which is going to feed into all of these um, apiaries. And it'll be all good. So I'm going to collect all the parts I need for all that. There's a lot of stuff. Wow. And, um, and then we'll get back together and do some stuff. Awesome. Okay, see you in a bit. Alright guys, here it is. 
Ender Dragon time. Special effects. Ender Dragon slain here. <laughs> See my last death. Now, um, yeah, that kind of sucked. What happened to all my XP? Well, I just kind of, I don't know, weird stuff happens. Okay. So. You missed the Ender Dragon fight, because I'm a derp again. <laughs> um, came in, didn't have any arrows. <laughs> I don't know what's up with that. Uh, let's see. Oh, I... Three, four, five. Okay. So I'm going to make an Enderman farm. Like you've not seen before. All right. And if you looked at my inventory, you probably noticed what I got in my inventory. Respect my authority. Okay, so we're going to go to... And I didn't bring any stairs, but generally you don't need them. I did bring wood. I guess I can use that. So I can go like this. And I'll just put a dude there. Maybe I should have added a little more. Um, Maybe I should have made my platform five by five. Let's go ahead and do that, because uh yeah, this is gonna get messy. Okay, so one, two, three, four, four, five. There. Um, let's see. I got my hammer. Where's my hammer at? Hammer's awesome. Stop! Hematana. <laughs> Sorry, that was bad. Um, let's see here. So this guy I want there. That guy I want there. Okay. Uh, one, two, three. Four. Five. So one, two, three, four. Let's see, one, two, three, four, five. So, okay, so let's fill this back in so these guys don't get zealous over here. And then, one, two, three, four, five. Okay, ah! Okay, let's go this way. That's what I thought. Okay. Okay, that's clear. Problem with down here. Okay. So we're gonna have to. Oh, did, did I not? Please tell me I put it in here. Yes. Um, let's see. I don't have any wood either. Oh gosh. I'm totally prepared. <laughs> All right, guys. Uh, give me a minute. All right, guys. Let me double check and make sure you're <laughs> recording you this time. <laughs> All right. So what we're going to do is take quicksand and put it in these corners. Now, if you notice, it's at the three high block. So it should be at the head height of the Enderman. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to add some 
half slabs down here, so if they decide to teleport down here, um, they, should, well, they shouldn't be able to teleport down here. So then we're going to come up here, and let's see. Sponge. Never used wood here, not sure if you can. Yep, see there goes dip dong there already. Yep, there he goes. Now these other guys, I don't know if they're gonna So I don't know if they're a three height or a two height. Sorry about that. Oh, and he teleported away like it was. Hey, guys. I can go. Stuck already. Oh, got a new hat even. You fall down. <laughs> They're not happy. I need to get a, uh, oh wow, look at that. <laughs> well, I don't have an ender problem anymore. <laughs> oh, you know what? You know what I need? I need this guy and this guy and this guy. Sure. Let's do this and let's get rid of all this garbage. And some of it not garbage because that's kind of why we're here. So there you go. My uh... <laughs> My, uh, what is it called? Quicksands? Is what they call it? Okay. I'll buy it. It's my, my quicksand ender farm. <laughs> Something different. Some of these guys. Hey, this guy's a short guy. This, these guys. Okay, so uh, two. Oh, 
All right, guys, I'm going to let you go so you don't have to <laughs> watch me kill Enderman over and over again. All right, thanks, guys. See you in a bit. All right, guys, I'm back. So, a little excursion. 190 ender pearls, so that'll be good for to hold us for a while. <laughs> don't need this guy anymore. And I also got a tier 5 Enderman Soul Shard. <clears throat> so I'll have to figure out how to use that because because they're um, non-hostile entities, the grinders won't grind them up. So um, might have to throw them in Let's make a soul cage real quick. So that, uh, we need one of these. Actually, you know what? Um, let's see. No, it, yeah. Well, that's all I need, wrong one. I was thinking jailer. Um, and then let's do a wireless. Let's do receiver. Want one of those transmitter. Want one of those. Um, let's do a let's do a switch. All right. So up top we have. Um, Let's turn this up a little bit. I like hearing what's going on. Okay, did I put it down? I saw something over here. Okay, I saw my imagination. Um, let's see. It's the imagination song. Okay, so we did. How far? How high is that? Not high enough. Um, actually what I want to do is, let's see if I can tear some of these out. Oop, I can take that guy out. There we go. Okay. So the problem we're going to have is, um, we're gonna have three high and two high mobs. Cause I'm not sure if a the shard will spawn the tots. So what I need to do is let's pull out is not that. <laughs> so what I'm gonna do is I'm going to I'm going to add another layer of iron spikes, put that up there, up at that level. So let's go. Okay. So I should have, yeah. We got a bunch of those and those. Okay. All right, let's see how this does. Oh, jeez. Okay. So iron. What? Um, hmm. So four, eight. Oh, geez, that has nothing. Um, doesn't have any iron blocks made. Um, I'm thinking we'll probably need three. Okay, now we need swords. So stick. Um, oh, we only need one stick. So iron sword, <laughs> iron sword. Okay, so we need two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. Okay. 
So we have nine of those. Okay, so iron spike. Should have enough to do one, two, three. Okay. Um, let's see here. We gotta keep the uh, bees going. Get the bees going too. See, I fell out of the world. <laughs> Ah, oh, that's too funny. <laughs> I didn't bring my arrows. I'm like, all right, I'm going to get him with my bow. I pull out my bow. Nothing. I'm like, oh, seriously? Oh, you know what? I only needed eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah, because I, I shrunk it down so it would only fit. Um, so the spawn area is a nine by nine because I like nine by nine spawn areas. But um, the crusher area is eight by eight. So that I would only have to make one, and I made, or two, and I made three. So let's see how this works. So let's... The reason I did this is I had blazes in here too. And I didn't want the blazes to be um, flying. If they flew and got kind of stuck, they'd end up up there. But... If it was down low, they'd end up getting stuck in a wall. So as it is now, everything's going to fly up and it's going to get squished. Toast smish. Okay, so now we need conveyors. I think I got all the conveyors. Okay. So we need a oh, conveyor. Oh, these are going to be fun. tell you tons of fun so now I need okay I'll stick on the torch <laughs> okay uh, let's see here so I need wrench okay there's a wrench oh dang I need to go back because I need to cut up some these once all right I'm gonna set this up and I'll we'll be back ah. <laughs> all right guys there it is my spawner let's close this door before things get nasty <laughs> I should probably put some glass around this so I can see through um, but yeah red means they die Look at all those tender pearls. Such a pretty sight. about <laughs> how long I can leave this on let's let's get these guys I want to see if um, let's grab these oh, let's grab all this garbage we'll grab that too there we'll leave this on for I don't know a half hour yeah all right. I'm gonna get some food and uh, we will update you when he comes back and you can watch the ender pearls as I hit pause. <laughs> Alright, you know those shows where you see people look into their closet and they go or something somebody did and go that's all wrong! It's all wrong! <laughs> I'm going to completely redesign this whole thing. 
I'm gonna move this a lot lower. I don't know how low, but I don't know. Let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So we got eight of them there. I have 16 with two, uh, two sets of, I might probably keep that the way it's set up, maybe, maybe, okay, but, um, so I want to add the cotton farm, so I'm going to have to kick this off again, which might take a while, but you know what? Sometimes it's worth it to do it right. Um, but if I want to add some more farms, um, I can't really connect them down. So, um, like here we're at, so here we're at 70, here we're at 62. I mean, I can drop this down to about 30, I think. And um, I might actually put, um, I think I'm going to put the boiler in the same room as the fuel and then uh, I think I'm only gonna have one boiler so it's not a big deal um, I mean I really don't need the mass amounts of energy I'm I've got enough if I look at my my inventory here um, I've got enough UU to probably do two hive um, ultimate hybrids which would be plenty of power and then when you come up here, um, oh, too far. <laughs> come up here. Um, honest, I was going to show you something up here, but I don't remember what it was. <laughs> yeah, I don't remember what it was. Oh, well. Must not have been important. Sorry, I just had to do that. That was cool. <laughs> uh, so we got this guy here. I, I honestly don't know what I was going to say. Well, this guy's running good. So this guy will have, it'll have 64 here. And then what I didn't know is it'll end up with 64 in here. And then it'll end up with 64 in here. So that's really cool. Yeah, that's going to be super cool. I like that. So I'll have three stacks of cold coke per uh, blast furnace. I mean, I may never use it, but it's a really... I, I'm liking the design. I'm amazed that it worked as well as it did. You just toss stuff in here and it ends up on the environment. Schnazzy. Okay, so I'm going to completely tear this apart and redesign it I'm gonna um, I'm gonna take these out I don't like them at least for for this I don't really like how they're working I'm gonna go ahead and put um, like my last build I had um, stuff going all the way down <laughs> I'll put the uh, level emitters on each one if they were just running on their own, it wouldn't be that big a deal. But, you know, I've got these guys. You know, i got wireless transmitters. I've got uh, level emitters up here. It's more complicated than it should have been with these guys. But, I mean, for, for when it started off, it worked really well. So, for an early, uh, for an early item transport system... It, it works really well, but in the later game, it just doesn't hold up. So, the energy's kind of funky and stuff. All right, guys, so um, I'm going to go build that, and um, we'll come up and finish up the episode, and I'll show you what it looks like and call it good. All right, guys, see you in a bit. Hey, guys, we're back. And, yep, out of time again. So I want to thank you guys again for stopping by. Um, if you enjoyed the video, please leave a like. If you're enjoying the series, please subscribe. Both of these help me out on the YouTube. And um, if you got any ideas, anything you want to see, any um, any curiosities that you're not sure about, you want 
something designed sp specifically to figure out a new way to do something. I love new ways, and I love challenges like that. So, hey, guys, um, drop me a comment. Let me know what you think. All right, guys, thanks again for stopping by. Take care. Have a good one.